You know, we've had some awful years this past since forever, but I do feel no, believe, no, hope, no, can confirm with all the confidence that I have that this year is going to be the best year ever. Yeah. Hello, you wonderful, optimistic, perfect, animated world. Hmm. <laughs> Somehow I'm not surprised. Well, it's only a matter of time until I find out why everything looks like a void of hopeless hellscape. <laughs> Sergio Dominguez! Mm hmm. I am the god of holidays! Uh huh. I need you. Yes, you, with all your pointless creativity to help save some of the most important holidays that we have. Oh, I need to get some more iced tea. Yes, holidays are important of keeping people together with a special cultural theme, tradition, or institution where we can all band together in happiness and cheer and just mention the holidays through social media. But these holidays have fallen apart and I need your help of all animated people. Mm-hmm. Sure. That's, uh... I can do that. So, with my help, I'm gonna transport you to certain periods of time before each pivotal moment of each holiday has begun to help save it because each of them has been destroyed or disrupted and you gotta help fix it and make the original origin story of the history of each holiday possible. Oh, cool. <laughs> Alright. By saving all the holidays of the past, we'll save the holidays of now and even the future, preventing this hellish landscape that just magically happened. So, are you up for it? Hmm. No, but I need a season worth of episodes, so okay. Okay, let's begin! Fwa! 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 To be continued. Well, thank you for watching this episode of The Sergio Show. It's going to be a beginning to a lot of episodes, to a season's worth of episodes of me trying to save each holiday for this season. Anyway, wish me luck and good luck in watching this season. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I am Sergio Dominguez saying have an animated day. Geo Studios. It's the Sergio Show. Oh, oh. Well. Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Sergio Dominguez with another episode of The Sergio Show. And this episode, I'm gonna save a holiday as a part of this season, me trying to save the holidays throughout this season. Starting with, uh, what is the first one? Valentine's Day. Oh, that's great. The holiday that reminds me that without my dog and my talent, I am super lonely. Ah, oh, but at least I can eat a lot of chocolate. Fwa! Fwa! So what do I need to do to save Valentine's Day? Well, you kind of sound like me for a moment. Anyway, you see that cloud over there? Yeah? 
Well, that's a special love cloud. In it are all the elements to create the very first Cupid of Valentine's Day. It needs to be born, but it's missing something, and you need to help it make it possible. Me? Okay, I, I don't know much about this, but okay, I'll give it a try. Me? Yeah. Huh. How do I talk to a magical cloud? Uh, hi, cloud, it's... I'm... you don't know me, but I'm Sergio, and I'm here to help you create Baby Cupid so Valentine's Day can be possible. So... Would you please? Hmm. No, nothing huh? Um... I don't know if this is possible, but I'm gonna try to check on you and see if there's any anything going on because you're not talking right now, and I don't even know if uh, you're that sentient. So let me just, if I can. Uh, so. uh, uh, I feel like something tingly, like 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 a tickling of the foot kind of tingle, but uh, I'm, I don't feel any essence of Cupid in this thing. <clears throat> Oh god, I feel like the longer I'm doing this, the more awkward it gets. Um... Huh. Oh! Can- can you sense that? I is that why you can't produce a Cupid? You're just not feeling it? Look, the only way that we can have a really happy environment... Well... Happier than this environment... ...is through the power of love. And we need a symbol of that to help us understand the magic of love. And maybe, with my love and support, you will create something that will influence the beauty of love in the most ritualistically way possible with Valentine's Day. So, uh, I'm also gonna give you a quick smooch, and if you're not happy about it, let me know, I will apologize. Uh, Now I want to shoot arrows at things for love! Whee! Ha! Who knew? That worked! Uh, now begin the tradition of just buying themed heart-shaped candy and having little kids give other little kids pointless commercialized beautiful cards. Yay! Fwah! You did it, Sergio. You saved Valentine's Day. Now on to saving the next holiday! <laughs> oh boy. It was kind of easy. I hope it doesn't get harder afterwards. Oh, you'll soon find out. Oh, holidays. To be continued. Well, that's all for this episode of The Sergio Show. I hope you enjoyed me saving Valentine's Day, kind of. Anyway, I'm Sergio Dominguez, saying, have an animated day. <laughs> Sergio Studios. It's the Sergio Show! Hey everybody, it's me. Anyway, we're on to the next holiday that I'm gonna save. Uh, so, uh, what is this one, uh, Lord of the Holidays? It's Easter! Oh, Easter. The holiday where everybody also gets to eat chocolate, but it's shaped like eggs this time! And it's supposed to celebrate something else that uh, is, uh, honestly, really too touchy of a subject for me to comfortably talk about! You see that bunny over there? Oh yeah, cute little bunny. Well, that's supposed to be the Easter Bunny! But you need to help him realize he needs to do the Easter tradition of hiding eggs. Uh, okay, uh, I'll, I'll try, but I'll, uh, 
That's kind of a weird order, but you know what? We're all cartoons here. What can, what can possibly go wrong? I'm going to use that cliche and hopefully nothing bad will happen. <laughs> uh, uh, hi there, uh, Mr. B Bunny, sir. Uh, yeah, look, I'm just going to cut to the chase. I'm here to help you uh, realize your purpose in life, and that is to uh, get a basket, uh, put a decorative color stylish eggs and for once a year you need to hide them so little kids can find them and and stuff so uh what do you say i think i'm gonna hear a yes <laughs> Oh, oh, no, no, okay, T -t talking to the bunny was not a good idea, okay, so, what else, what else can I do? Oh, I got it, by setting up the things, maybe the bunny will do it, okay, there we go. All right, you got this. Come on. Come on. Da! Ah, darn it. Hmm. Since it's a cartoon bunny, maybe I should answer it like a cartoon bunny, if you know what I mean. Mm, boom. <laughs> Eh, uh, what's up, bunny bro? Yeah, I know, you're a bunny a few words. Listen, uh, medical assistant, I got an idea for you to surely get all the carrots and female bunnies you want. You see the basket and see those eggs? People love if you just hide them all around the place once a year. So, what do you say? What? what? No, of course you want to do it. You, you do want to do it. It looks like fun. You do want to do it. You do. You do. You do. You do. You do. You don't. You don't. You don't. You don't. Okay, you, you got me. I know when you've made up your mind. So, do what you gotta do. <laughs> Ain't I a stinky person for being so stinky for making a holiday possibly exist? Well, you did it again. You saved the second holiday. Yeah, it was a lot to it, medical assistant. Fwah! Thank you very much for watching this holiday-themed episode of The Sergio Show. I am Sergio Dominguez, saying, have an animated day. Hey, what's up? I'm Sergio Dominguez with a special Saving the Holiday episode of The Sergio Show. So what's the next one, God of Holidays? This one is St. Patrick's Day. Oh, okay, cool. You see, that is the leader of the leprechauns. 
All you have to do is help kickstart the tradition of the holiday by having him share his ability to find the magic of the pot of the gold. Okay. I'll do this. Um, ahem, excuse me? I, I'm Sergio Dominguez. So, Mr. Leprechaun, sir, you're pretty happy with you and your leprechaun friends, you know, having a good time doing whatever here, right? Well, wouldn't it be nice if once a year you can share that with everybody else in the around the world? Yes, I, I can see that, but, um... How about I enjoy it with you? And maybe we can have a nice montage together, enjoying the stuff, and you'll see that there should be a holiday based on this. Anyway, let's just begin the montage. Yeah, well, I realize I, I can't handle St. Patrick's Day that well. Thank you very much for watching this holiday themed episode of The Sergio Show. I am Sergio Dominguez saying have an animated day. Sergio Studios. It's the Sergio Show! Oh! <laughs> hey, you know who it is and you know what show this is. Anyway, I'm here to save uh, another holiday. So what is it, Lord of Holidays? What's the next holiday I need to save? April Fools. Oh! The holiday I'm closely related to, because I'm born a couple weeks after that. Well, by the end of the month. Cool, I don't care. Fwa! Fwa! Alright. You see that guy over there? Y yeah That will be the April Fool. And you need to influence him to start a day of him expressing pranks and comedy and the culture of it in order to have April 1st April Fools possible! Oh! Me influence him to laugh and comedy? Oh, we are surely doomed. Oh well, better give it a try. Hi there, how's it going? My name is Ben. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just joking. My real name is Sergio. And yes, that is my real name. D Hello, are you okay? Bro, you right? Look, I know you're sad, even though I don't know why you're sad, but you know, today is April 1st. You can you can influence maybe a special holiday for it, you know? You know, you're, you're a kind of funny looking guy, you, you know, you can inspire comedy, you can, you can maybe even influence other people to express comedy. Um, uh, let, let me give you a joke. <clears throat> How do you make an internet video go viral? By not washing your hands! <laughs> uh. Either you haven't heard that joke before, or the audience has heard that joke before. Um... Uh... So what's the deal with 
everything in culture. Everything's not accurate, nobody can agree to it, and it's so darn flawed to be anything else. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Gosh, darn it! Oh, I got one! I got one you're gonna really like! <sighs> that was more than I expected! Oh, man. Come on! You're supposed to be the April Fool! Alright. I knew I had to do this eventually, but I want to warm up first before I get to it. But I gotta pull off the ultimate prank to make you understand that you will be the April Fool. Huh? <laughs> ah! Ow. <laughs> April Fools! <laughs> Aww, now that's what I'm talking about. Also, I'm in some amount of pain. Well, you did it again! Yes, I did. Again, like real comedy, it wasn't easy, and it was painful, and some people got upset over it. So, let's go on to the next holiday. Fwah! Fwah! Thank you very much for watching this holiday-themed episode of The Sergio Show. I am Sergio Dominguez, saying, have an animated day. Studios. It's the Sergio Show! Whoa! Hey, it's me, Sergio, with, uh, you know, my own show. So, I'm here again trying to save another holiday. So, what's the one holiday we have for this episode? God of Holidays that I need to save? Actually, you need to save two holidays this time. Oh, two holidays. Uh, what? Yes, you need to save Mother's Day and Father's Day. Oh, okay. Fwa! You see those two magical spirits over there? Yeah. They are both the god and goddess of mother and fatherhood. They need to realize that they need to have their own holidays in their own respective months, and you need to convince them of that. Alright. No, if it makes my parents happy, sure. Let's do this. Um, hi, Spirit Mommyhood and Spirit Daddyhood. I don't know uh, if you know me, but, uh... Oh, we do! Yes, we do! You're our son! A what? Yes. Yes. As the spirit of the fatherhood and the spirit of the motherhood, we uh, thoroughly understand that every living creature is our child. So what would you like to speak to us, son? Oh, um... Look, I just want each of you to have your own holiday and your own month in May and June. So I'm just wondering if you're uh, okay with that. Sure thing, son. Yeah, sure. We can do that. Oh, cool. Uh, thank you. I really appreciate it. Well, I'm gonna go. Wait, wait. Did you finish your homework? What? what? Yeah, son. Did you do all your chores? Uh, no. Do your chores and homework first, son. But I'm an adult, and you guys are not... Well, you kind of... My parents, but my parents that didn't give birth to me and... Look, son, we need you to be a good boy and do your homework and chores. 
Yes, yes, if you want us to have our own holidays, you need to do all of your work around the house. What? But, I, I, uh, go on, get cracking. But, I, can I just save April Fools again? Ugh! Ugh! Done. I spent eight hours doing chores! Well, everything looks beautiful. Good job, son. Yes, great job, son. Just for that, here's 25 cents. Honestly, thanks. And we'll go ahead and have our own holidays. Thank you very much for understanding that. The true meaning of parenting is love. And obeying what we do because we're just human beings that want to be served while we're serving, but we need to have someone to serve us, and that's why we have children. All right, see ya. Huh. You did it. You made Father Mother's Day possible. All right, let's just get to the next one. Ugh. Fwa! Ugh. Oh, I'm still exhausted with those chores. Anyway, that's all for this holiday-themed episode of The Sergio Show. I hope you learned about Parents' Day or something. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I am Sergio Dominguez, saying, have an animated day. <laughs>
Uh, and uh, before you do, I want to say these words. <clears throat> Trick or treat. And, you know, if you can, put something. Please. Oh, uh, thank you. You see, that was that was fun. How would you like to do that all throughout the month of October? And by the end of the month, that's the day where you can really celebrate with, you know, people hanging out and, and, and collecting candies, you know, house to house, all that stuff. You know, as a ghost, I think that's a good idea. So do you think that's cool? We can call it, um, it's pretty hollow and, um, it has a, a ween to it too. So how about hollow ween? How does that sound? <laughs> huh, that was pretty cool. Well, you did it. You saved Halloween. That was incredibly scary, and I don't want to do that again. But I'll keep saving holidays, apparently. Alright, on to the next holiday! Fwah! Well, thank you for watching this Me Saving Halloween episode of The Sergio Show. See you in the next holiday that I'm going to save. I'm Sergio Dominguez, saying... Have an animated day. Sergio Studios. It's the Sergio Show! Hey everybody, how's it going? You know, it's me, and it's my show, Sergio, and uh, here we are. Uh, we're gonna save another holiday. So, holiday god, what's this holiday? The holiday is Thanksgiving. Oh, I do enjoy Thanksgiving. I mean, yeah, all of us are just waiting for Christmas, but yeah, Thanksgiving. Oh, we, we can set up food and learn the spirit of sharing and just enjoy the, the, the parades and all the wonderful stuff until Christmas gets here. And, uh... Mm -hmm. Fwa! Fwa! So, what do I need to do to save Thanksgiving? No. 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 No, no, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No and sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, 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 no. No, sorry, sorry, no. No, sorry. No and sorry. Look. I'm in, I love this holiday, I'm in favor of this holiday happening, but the way that it originally happened, and the ideas around it, is so, so, not comfortable. I am sorry. I'm gonna make Thanksgiving happen, but it's not gonna be in this way. No, and sorry. So, God of Holidays, you understand where I'm coming from. Just give me another way to save this holiday, just for, for this moment's sake. Uh... Oh, uh, okay. Fwa! Fwa! You see that balloon you have in your hands? Yes. That's a balloon of a turkey. All you need to do is inflate it and hold on to it and walk down this, this road. Oh, uh, from this end to that end? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Turkey balloon. Cool. Uh, 
And here comes Sergio Dominguez with the turkey balloon. Oh, the turkey is such a beloved and reason why Thanksgiving exists. Such a beautiful, delicious bird. And it's this guy just holding it down the street. Oh, it just makes you want to watch this once a year forever and ever. Along with other commercialized balloons and floats. Oh, ho, ho, ho. We'll be back after these messages. <laughs> and there we go. Well, in some ways you... Did save the holidays. You saved the holiday of Thanksgiving. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, let's just let's just get to the next holiday for gosh sake. Fwah! Well, that's all for this Thanksgiving episode of the Sergio Show. Sorry it was a mess, but uh, you know, Thanksgiving's backstory and all that crazy stuff. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I'm Sergio Dominguez saying have an animated day. Sergio Studios. It's the Sergio Show! Hey everybody, this is the Sergio Show, and I am Sergio Dominguez, and I'm here to save yet another holiday! So what is it, God of Holidays, do I need to save? You know, it's Christmas! Yay, Christmas! My favorite economy-based holiday. So, how do I save it? Fwah! Fwah! Huh. By the looks of it, it looks like it's already saved. Wait a minute. I saved this holiday before. Wait, did I? There was a point where Christmas was almost not made, but then Santa Claus came in and saved a version of you that didn't know Christmas. And then you saved Christmas ultimately, and everything went back to normal. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute. How does Santa Claus know me at that point? It was a long time ago before I was born, but at the time that he was creating Christmas, I didn't exist. So when I didn't exist and Christmas was being created, it was being interrupted and he needed my saving? He needed me to save him, yet I didn't exist? H how did he know I exist and travel to, to my time when he didn't know me back then? I mean, everything I'm saying, I don't think it makes sense. I don't even think the question makes sense. And also, I think it doesn't really matter because this is an animated show. And that episode was a lot of fun to make and very enjoyable and shouldn't be really questioned that much. So, uh, what I got to do to, I don't know, resave Christmas or whatever. You see that elf over there? Yes. Well, that elf is actually evil, and he wants to end Christmas before it begins by secretly murdering Santa Claus. Oh no! So I gotta murder the elf? Well, yeah, but, uh, yeah. As magical and not as gruesome as possible. Okay, I'll try. Ho 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 ho! Everybody here is doing a great job on making Christmas possible. Oh, I want to thank everybody who worked so hard and all the toys for all the girls and boys for the very first Christmas. Oh, and what I love the most is all of you did it for love. The love of the holidays. And none of you will turn your back on me and try to kill me at this moment. Oh, I'm gonna end Christmas before it begins! Die, Shanna! Surge is coming down this Christmas tree, mother trucker! Get over here, elf! <laughs> 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 Oh, ho, 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 break it up, you two. Oh, I may not know who you are in this timeline, but I know you're here to save Christmas. And don't worry, I know. Because this little guy just appeared on my naughty list, ho, ho. 
And this was all a setup for this being possible. And how do I know that? Well, I'm Santa Claus, and I just realized that I can see y'all. Oh. oh, so what are you gonna do, Santa? Oh, since he's an elf that's turned naughty, he needs to be happy and good again. Oh, but how? He needs a little bit of love and some sort of magic of the holidays. Magic of the holidays? Oh, I got it. Let me see if I can do this. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh, what the? Oh, oh I, I want to be helpful with Christmas. I love Christmas. Let's have Christmas happen. Oh, there's the spirit of Christmas. Oh, you have something there. It's the spirit of Christmas. Yes, Santa, it is. And with Christmas happening, Everybody will have the Christmas spirit with love and sharing and being kind to others and enjoying the gifts that they've wanted, hopefully. Oh, I see, Sir Joe. Oh, we're gonna make Christmas the best as possible and hopefully we'll do better and better with newer toys and technology, all to spread love of this wonderful holiday. Anyway, thank you very much and you'll be on the good list forever! <laughs> Is there anything else I can do for you as Santa Claus? Actually, yeah, you, you can. Can you please appear on my show a couple of times throughout the series? Oh, uh, sure. Well, no problem. Whatever that means. Oh, ho, 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 ho. all right. I saved Christmas. Now let's go on to the next holiday. Oh, this will be the most challenging holiday ever. Oh, uh, sure. After what I've been through, I guess. Fwah! Well, that's all for me saving Christmas for like the one millionth time on The Sergio Show. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Sergio Dominguez saying have an animated day. Studios. It's the Sergio Show! Well, here I am, Sergio Dominguez, with the Sergio Show and me saving what appears to be the last holiday of this season. So, God of the Holidays, what is the last holiday do I need to save? The last holiday you need to save is New Year's. Oh. Fwah! You see that big, beautiful ball up there? Yeah. It's nice. It's in a very long stick. It is 365 feet tall. It needs to go down to this platform to begin the new year. And then Baby New Year will be born. So you need to make that ball drop. Okay. How am I going to get up there? I'll give you a heads up. Fwah! Fwah! Oh, okay. I'm, I'm here. Well, here I am on top of the ball of the year on apparently day one. And this year has to end somehow. So, let's do this. Let's ball, drop this ball. Let's have this. Let's go through a year. Oh, I'm going to feel old by the end of this. Who am I kidding? I'm old now. All right. Come on. Let's do this. Come on. I'm pushing it. Oh, my gosh. There's not enough days in the year. I can't. I can't do it. I'm not even halfway through the year. No, oh. God, this is so tough. This whole thing of going through the year is just so frustrating and exhausting. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we, we do this 
all the time, hour by hour, minute by minute, second by second, going through time. And as time goes by, we go through holidays. We go through holidays that are important parts of our lives that make us happy and gives us memories and experiences of learning and emotions and all that stuff. Huh. I guess living through a year is not just waiting for it to end. It's about experience, understanding, love, celebration, patience. Huh. I... I get the true magic of the of this holiday. Huh. There's just really hope this holiday understands itself. And it's also about partying and drinking and giving somebody a kiss as soon as the year begins. Huh? Uh huh? What? Oh, it's working! It's working! Yeah! Wh Whoa! Sure flies when you're having fun. Oh, boom. oh, 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 huh? <laughs> Happy New Year! <laughs> oh, <hey>. oh. <laughs> I did it! I saved the last holiday, and uh, oh, congratulations! Whoa. Huh? Oh my gosh, it's Toon City back to normal! I did it! I saved all the holidays of this season! Oh my gosh! Everything's back to normal and not a painful hellscape. Uh, well, I guess you'll be you learned. Well, honestly, there's nothing to really learn because every, every holiday was on purpose and accurate. So I just hope you were just entertained that I went through holidays and tried to save them. So I hope you enjoyed just this season of The Sergio Show. It's a themed holiday season and I hope you liked it. Let me know in the messages somewhere, someplace. Thank you very much for watching. I am Sergio Dominguez saying have an animated day. Huh. Wouldn't it be funny if there was a holiday based on me? Oh, uh, that would be awesome. Especially if it's on April 29th. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>